Hello everyone and welcome to the DPP Podcast. I'm your host Ryan Mondes. This is episode number 309 for January 23rd, 2024. Welcome to the Disney Pins Blog Podcast. The latest news on Disney pin trading and collecting from around the world. Welcome back to the show everyone. Hope you guys are doing well. Since I didn't have a podcast episode last week, I will just be summarizing this week. But of course, all the pin news is up on DisneyPinsBlog.com. For housekeeping, I just want to mention our January giveaway winner has been announced. Congratulations to Ariella in Florida. And be sure to check back soon for our February giveaway. All right, now onto the pin news. First, we're going to start off with Box Lunch. They had a bunch of new pin releases this past week. First up are two new Aristocats Kittens pin releases. They are both $10.90 each. One features the three kittens playing with a shoe. And the other one features the three kittens playing with some yarn. Then there was also three new Aristocat kitten pins in the Dome series at Box Lunch. These are the ones that have the character on the outside. And then there's the uh, 3D dome element with the little beads inside. The borders of the pin also have glitter embellishments. So these are more of an elevated pin at Box Lunch. That's why the retail price is $18.90 each. And they also had three new pins in their Silhouette series at Box Lunch. These one feature the Little Mermaid. First pin is a silhouette of Ariel and Flounder. Second is Ariel and Flounder again with the sunset in the background. And then the third one features Ariel, Flounder, and Sebastian. All of those are $10.90 each. Next, there were two new Mickey Mouse pins at Box Lunch. First one features Mickey's Garage. He is riding a motorcycle. It reads Mickey's Garage, high quality, ask for the mouse on it. And then the uh, second one is a Mickey Mouse license plate. It's got a tropical flair to it with the surfboard and the flower in the background. Both of those are also $10.90 each. And then finally at Box Lunch were three new Rapunzel pins from Tangle. First one features Rapunzel and her tower with some floral designs. Second is Rapunzel and Pascal in the balcony. And then the third one is Rapunzel with the lanterns. Those are also $10.90 each. Next up is our sales at DPB Store. We had some of the new Robin Hood Artland pins at DPB Store. Uh, I do believe now they are all sold out. We had very limited quantity, but there are other characters in this series coming soon. So be sure to check back dpbstore.com. And then also in case you missed it, uh, two weeks ago we had our Valentine's pin release featuring Hercules and Megara. It's limited edition of 300. Retail price is $15 and that is available now. And then finally at DPP store, we have a very exciting brand new pin series coming this Thursday. It features Disney villains. I'm very excited about it. I've been working on it for a very long time. I'm happy how they turned out. It is definitely a more high end elevated pin. Limited edition of 250 and it features Disney villains. So be sure to check DPP store and Disney pins blog this Thursday. All right, next is Shop Disney. They had a brand new series that released called Marvel Superpower Pops. And the first release features Captain America. This collection is exclusive to shopdisney.com. For 2024, there will be 12 pins in total. Limited edition of just 1,000. Retail price is $19.99 each. And uh, this one first released on Tuesday, January 16th. Next at Shop Disney, they also got in on the Sleeping Beauty 65th anniversary action. They had a Maleficent pin that released. Limited edition of 3,050. That released on Friday, January 19th, 2024. And is a Shop Disney exclusive. Next, we'll head over to Alani Disney Resort and Spa in Hawaii. They had a 2024 dated pin that released. It features Mickey and Minnie and has the same style as the 2024 data pins at Disneyland and Walt Disney World. But this one is exclusive to Alani. All right, then finally we have Disney Parks. First, there's a new Star Wars Droid Mystery Pin Set that released last week. 
There are eight different droid pins in total, two randomly selected per box. Open edition, retail price is $19.99. And you can find those at all major pin stores around Walt Disney World. Pretty sure it's out at Disneyland now as well, too. Next, there's a brand new Magical Mystery pin set. This is series number 25, and it features cats and dogs. It's very similar to a previous cat and dog mystery pin set at Disney Parks, uh, where it has their collar at the bottom. But this one, the pins are a bit bigger. They did increase the size for this collection. It's one randomly selected pin per pouch, and the retail price is $9.99. Next, there was a new Disney Vacation Club exclusive pin set. There's two pins on the card. One features Mickey Mouse, and the other one reads Disney Vacation Club member, established 1991, and has lots of resort icons around the outside. It's limited edition. I'm not sure of the exact edition size, uh, but the retail price is $29.99. I spotted this one over the weekend in the gift shop at Disney's Boardwalk Resort. And then finally, at Disney Parks, we have the limited edition pin releases this week, all released on Tuesday. First up is the most popular series of the week, the Sleeping Beauty 65th Anniversary Pin Collection. These released on both coasts. We did a little teaser the day before on Monday, but one features Aurora and Maleficent with Diablo. That one's limited release, $17.99. Next is the Maleficent Dragon Pin, which is limited edition of 3000, 1999. Then you have the Three Fairies Pin, also limited edition of 3000, 1999. Then there was a two pin box set, which these pins are definitely larger than the uh, single carded pins. You have Prince Philip there in Aurora, limited edition of 2500. Retail price for that box set is $54.99. Then there was a very cool Sleeping Beauty 65th Anniversary Mystery Pin Set, which features various characters, and wherever you put them together, it is the silhouette of the uh, Maleficent Dragon. That set is limited release. Retail price is $29.99 per box of two pins, and there are 10 pins in total. Also this week at Disney Parks was the Lunar New Year pin, which features Elliot from Pete's Dragon. I actually spotted this one a few days earlier at Epcot. They did release it early. Uh, it's limited edition of 4000 retail price $19.99. And then there was a new Disney Rewards 2024 exclusive pin featuring Dumbo. This is the Disney Visa card member pin. It's limited release, retail price $17.99. And then finally was the very first pin for Tiana's Bayou Adventure attraction at Disney Parks. This also released today on Tuesday, January 23rd. It features Tiana's Tiara. That is the pin there, but the backer card has concept art on it. Very nice looking uh, backer card there. Definitely a keepsake collectible. It's limited release, retail price $17.99. And again, this is the very first pin release for the new attraction. All right, so that's going to do it for episode number 309, your January 2024 week four Disney pin news. Thank you guys very much for listening and watching. Hope you have a great rest of your week. See ya.